Hold on one second. Mm -hmm. You know, first of all, I did this with the lead wire. To make sure that I had everything. See where my bevel is? You know? This is like the fourth inter intercostal space, mid axillary. And if you look, okay, bring your, bring your arm out still. Yeah, right up over there. You see where my bevel is? It's lined up with that. It's right there in the center. Hold on. Wait, hold on one second. But there it is. I got it lined up, okay? Okay. And Ethan, you go up over there for me, please. Mm -hmm. If you hit all pressure for me, yeah, give me my, yeah, I forgot my mask. If you hit all pressure for me, please. I got three of them. You said zero is all three at the same time. And all of the three, so they all went to zero. All right, we're good. Mm -hmm. And this here, I was just telling Ethan, this hub got to be up. I'm flushing everything. Okay. All right. Now from this screen, We're gonna do our wedge first. Yeah. So you go to your wedge screen. And then down here, I'll hit restart wedge, but you'll look down here where the balloon is. Okay. okay. And this is off. Sorry. I'm gonna line it up, move this, and this is the maximum. This is like 1.5. Yeah, that's the maximum. Okay. Yeah. And this is the maximum. Yeah. Everything's fine. Okay, 1.5. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then I'm gonna watch my waveform. Okay, we'll clear that, clear that out. Oh, let me see if I can have him lay down a little, a little further, if you can. Let me know how low you can go, sir. This is only if you go up so low. Is that okay there? Uh, pretty low, okay. Okay, okay. All right, so I'm gonna start recording here. You know, you go in on in expiration. Okay. You wedge. Okay. And I'm looking to see from until I see my wave. You, only, you inflate up until you see your wave form. Yeah, as you're inflating the balloon, there we go. Yeah, there so we go. Perfect. Okay, I can stop now. Yeah. Okay. okay. And you can go to the balloons mm -hmm. back down. Yes. Use this tracing here to get in the middle. I just wish that we could move that screen over. Yeah, so when so I hit whenever I hit um, I hit arrows, store, uh -huh. I hit store as you're wedged, mm -hmm. and then that's the screen it gives you when you hit edit. Yeah. So that's as far over as it'll go. They need to fix that. Yeah. So, but could, I could, it's like I can really get, you know, you're gonna get a good idea. Yeah. So I would say, come up a little higher. Ten? No. Because it was twenty last time. Yeah, that's why I, I don't like that screen. Come up a little higher. It's only 11, you're not moving that far. Come back up a little bit. I want to try and see if I can find that. Come up a little bit more. Let's go right here. I think maybe that one. Yeah. 14. It's about 14.
that's more close when you look at my CBP. Right, because it's going to be your diet. And if you can't yeah, get a wedge, yeah. you just use your diastolic yeah. mm -hmm. for your yeah, PIP. Yeah. So, yeah, that would be closer. I would, I would say the 14 is a little bit more closer. Okay. I just wish that screen, know, that, that screen couldn't get, I couldn't figure out the screen couldn't get no wider hot. Yeah, because on here, as soon as it started to wedge, I hit store tracing and then um, edit from there. So, it, um, let me do it. I'll do it one more time. Okay. See if we can get it. Just one more. You don't want to be doing it all the time, you know. Yeah, you just don't really just want to leave the balloon up for more than like five seconds. Yes. Okay. okay. Yes. Once we get a wedge, once it's right. fully on, then I'll try to Yeah. Let's let's, yeah. Yeah. Oh. So you're watching him when you, uh -huh. uh, when yeah, you yeah, the white. So exhalation. Uh -huh. Yeah, in exhalation. And you can really do the balloon up pretty mm -hmm. quick. Yeah. Okay. Oh, perfect. Yeah. So that looks better. Yeah, it's better. So now you can see his expirations and his inspirations. Yeah. You bring the triangle in the middle of this. That's better. I, I like yeah, that better. better. So now you can. Mm-hmm. <coughs> so we'll bring it down. Come up a little bit more. That's end expiration uh -huh. right there. End expiration. That should be your end expiration. That, yeah, so that's, that's 24. Better. 24. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. 25 24. even. You can maybe do 25 for this one. There you go. That looks good right there. I think. Come down a little bit and see. I'll go to 24. Okay. I like that. That's what are you better. doing when you're moving those? No, um, it's just moving this white line mm -hmm. to just a measure. Yeah. you want to be in the expiration to get your yeah, right there. wedge and pressure. How do you tell the difference between expiration and inspiration? See how the uh, tracing goes up and down? Uh -huh. Yeah, and that's in expiration right there. Inspiration so you have the least. Inspiration is down. Inspiration is down, in expiration right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. And can we, let's get a printer to print the footage. Yeah, I print it. Okay, that's better. All right. Okay. That's All right, so now we'll do the um, cardiac output. output. So it prints out to the printer. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's better. All right. So this one you go to cardiac output here, mm -hmm. and this will bring you up to your screen here, and then you'll inject here. Mm -hmm. So once she's ready, you've got your um, D5 in a bag up there. Mm -hmm. Then you'll pull to the syringe. Yeah. And I'll make sure this is my proximal injectate point. Mm -hmm. This goes to your CVP yeah. line, CVP line. The only thing I just wondered, they, they put the swan in them, but they didn't, they used the, the, um, the other one. Okay. So that says maybe you can ask them about that. Yeah, you're going to turn off to your CV monitor. Yeah, I will. The patient. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm just standing mm -hmm. That's my line right there. Mm -hmm. I mean, excuse me. Because that's the jet that could go inside there. I'm pulling up 10 cc's. Years ago, this you can so do. The D5 is in this one. Right, okay. yeah, the proximal injectate okay. for the cardiac output. Okay, I'll tell you, are mm -hmm. you ready? I'll let you know. Yeah, I'm ready now. Okay, mm -hmm. so you put the start CO button. Mm -hmm. You'll hear a beep and it'll say inject now, and that's mm -hmm. when she'll push. And you gotta push it within four seconds. Okay. Within four and four seconds. Mm -hmm. And then you wait until it Yeah, wait for the, the tracing. Yeah, and you could do this three to five times, and you take your best average, take okay. your average. All right, 6 we're 6.97. Okay. I'm ready for the next one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. So 
what you'll try and do is when you're injecting that, just try and be persistent. Mm -hmm. Like with the, the how, with the, how, how fast you push the flow rate. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Tap it, it'll turn it red so it yeah, won't be used. Like that one. Yeah. Okay. So what are you looking I'm for? I'm gonna to take too long. Okay. Okay. Have my numbers a little bit more consistent. Okay. Yep. That You're just looking long, at the right? CEO number. Cardiac, Cardiac output. output. Okay. Cardiac input. Yep. Alright, you yeah. start. Do you want to use those three or do one more? Let me do one more. Let me do one more. Okay. Because I might get rid of that 6.97. So let's do one more. All right, you pulled back. Mm hmm. Okay. Let's see. 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 Let's see